I'm going to demonstrate palpation of the tendon for the extensor pollicis longus muscle. The extensor pollicis longus muscle attaches along the posterior aspect of the interosseous membrane, uh, in addition to the posterior aspect of the radius and the ulnar. It continues distally to insert into the posterior aspect of the base of the distal phalanx. So it's going to do extension at the interphalangeal joint. It'll do extension at the uh, metacarpal phalangeal joint of thumb, and also extension at the carpal metacarpal a joint and assist in some radial deviation. So it's going to go across in, in this fashion. All right? And it's pretty easy to palpate and to also visualize. So with the client's elbow flex 90 degrees, wrist is in neutral, you have them go into extension and you'll be able to see the tendon. So if you just palpate along the posterior distal aspect of the radius, move into the crease of the wrist, and then move towards the first digit, you can palpate the tendon all along through that particular area.